Hello my little Christmas elves. <laughs> Welcome back to 12 Days of Jesmas. For today's video I'm just going to show you all of my Christmas jumpers. My Christmas jumper collection. Um, a few of them are new and still available and some of them aren't. Um, Christmas jumpers are one of those things like because you don't wear them that often they don't get a lot of wear so they last for ages I think anyway a few of these I've had for years so yeah I hope you're enjoying this collection of videos I'm doing so far and enjoying the Christmassy festive backgrounds and yeah I'm not wearing a Christmas jumper today although this always feels really Christmassy to me I don't know why but it just does um, because I wanted to show you them all. So yes, I'm sure you'll see most of these throughout me me making these videos because I'll be wearing them in them. But yes, let's just get started. So the first one I actually got from Primark and this might have been the first Christmas jumper I bought myself as an adult, I think, maybe. Um, this was from Primark. It's tiny, it doesn't fit me, obviously, anymore. Um, but he's like all 3D and fluffy. To be fair though, he's gone through the wash a few times and his beard and his hair is looking a bit worse for wear. Not from afar, but just from up close. Um, but yeah, this was from Primark. It's so soft on the inside. I just really loved it. And yeah, that was number one. Number two, I adore. I got this three Christmases ago, I want to say. This is actually from George Asda. Um, I think they have really great, like them and Tesco's have really great Christmas jumpers. Um, it says kiss me, it's Christmas and it's got these little uh, penguins on but it also lights up and plays jingle bells. No, it's Santa Claus is coming to town. <laughs> wish you a Merry Christmas. I'm well confused. What song was that? Maybe it's a mixture, remix, but yeah it's just cream and I liked the fact that it wasn't like, like that first one, it wasn't like knitted because a lot of um, Christmas jumpers are knitted and different fabrics can really irritate my skin. So I really like these type of sweatshirts that are really soft on the inside because I know I can wear them all day without them bothering my skin. This next one might be my fave. Um, I got this from ASOS last year. Um, it, I just, I just, it's just the cutest thing. It's got sequins, it's got pom-poms, it's pink, it's super soft. Now this is more like a proper knitted jumper than that, but it's still not, and it's actually quite thin, but it's like a close knit, so it's like still warm. It's still warm, it's still a good jumper, but it's just Oh look, look at Santa. I love that he's all sequined. Oh, it's just a really nice quality jumper. I love that it's baby pink. I adore anything with pom-poms on, so that I think might be my fave. This next one, two years ago, my mum bought me this um, because, yeah, so because the dog on the front reminded her of our dog who had just passed away. Um, Kat Kitson do like a range of things that have different dogs on and one of the dogs that they always do just really looks like our old dog Alfie um, so my mum always buys me stuff that has him on it which I love um, and this was just a gorgeous Christmas jumper but look it says Merry Christmas and it's very it's very Kat Kitson again it's really soft on the inside just a grey round neck sweatshirt really easy to wear um, a little, I think, although it says Merry Christmas on it, I think it's like it's more subtle than like my pink pom-pom sequin Santa face one. Um, I love the dog on it and yes, I'm going to make sure I wear that this year. This next one was also from George at Asda and I think I got this last year. I think I did. Um, I just really loved it. It's got um, Christmas trees all over it. And they're actually like really, really textured. They're like fuzzy, like kind of tinsel, but softer than tinsel. And the stars on top of the trees are all actual like beads, like they're actual beads that are sold, so, that have been sewed on. Um, and again, I don't know, I've got this thing about cream. I don't like black and dark colors for Christmas. I, to me, it's just like the opposite of Christmassy. 
although the next two ones are dark colours. <laughs> um, but yeah, I just prefer, I think these just feel more festive to me, um, more my style. Again, this is like the same material as my pink fave, um, just a light knit and very comfy. I adore that. This next one was my like full on gaudy Christmas tacky goodness and I adore it. I got it from Primark um, a few years ago now and I wore it on Christmas Day the year that I bought it um, and it's incredibly thick and soft. I know it's a dark colour but it's actually navy not black um, but I just I loved it. I loved the candy canes, the snowmen, this to me is what a, a Christmas jumper should be like, like a bit ugly and a bit tacky. Um, but yeah, this was from Primark. And again, the Christmas tree studs are actually like beads that are sewed on. And yeah, this is just incredibly warm. This is one that I wouldn't want to wear with a coat over the top because I'd want everyone to know, like I am wearing a Christmas jumper. <laughs> This next one my dad actually surprised me with. He went to Tesco's, I think just to get some food for him and my mum, like some food shopping. And he came back with a Christmas jumper for her and a Christmas jumper for me. And it was this one and it's black. And I wore it a lot in like my last year's Christmas videos. It's black and it's like got an elf body and it says hashtag elfie. I normally would think that was quite cringe, but because my dad bought me as a surprise, like a little gift, just because he saw it and thought of me, I thought that was really cute. And like, he always takes a piss out of how many selfies I take, so yeah. And it came with a little headband that's got like an elf's hat, which I thought was really sweet. Um, and again, it's very, very soft. It's those sweatshirts with the really soft insides, so it's a pleasure to wear. And yeah, this was from F&F &F Tesco's. Look how shiny. These last two are my brand new ones for this year. I try to only stick to buying like one or two a year because otherwise I end up like with no time to wear any of them because there's only so many days around Christmas. Um, but this this one I absolutely adored and it sat in my wish list um, on ASOS for way too long and then it sold out and it was sold out before we got... Um, no, I was waiting until we got paid and then it sold out and I was gutted and then it came back just in my size so I literally immediately grabbed it. It is from um, Monkey, Monkey, M-O-N-K-I, you know that brand that I don't know how to pronounce. That's one of my favourite brands so I should know how to pronounce. It's from them and it's this. <laughs> I just love it. This is so me. Bright pink, the um little Chris christmas trees if you can't tell it does look like christmas puds from afar i think which is i'm not mad at um but yeah it's got christmas trees with baubles all on them but the way they're done is like proper cartoony kitschy um just cute and i adore it it's so soft it's lovely i love how bright it is and i just want to wear this all year round to be honest <laughs> And my newest one came today. It literally just came as I was about to film this video. The postman dropped it off. And I was like, oh, just in time. This one is kind of, sort of, a replacement for my Primark really gaudy one that I love. Not a replacement in that I'm going to throw that Primark one away. But it doesn't currently fit me. Um, and it's a bit too... Like, you know what Primark jumpers are like? They're really thick, but they're not the softest on the inside. So... I don't like wearing it for like a day out somewhere, I'd have to wear it just for a couple of hours, like otherwise it does irritate my skin and it's also so thick that it's awkward under some of my some of my coats. So I wanted one that was that kind of gaudy, themey with like candy canes and that colourway of like blue, red, pink. Um, and then I saw this and it was from Monkey and I was like, you know what, it's got to be mine. Um, and it's actually... I think made to look like it's one of those type of knitted jumpers but it's not so it's again another lovely really soft sweatshirt and it looks like this Woo! also it made me laugh because it says hey babe it's christmas on it <laughs> which i just thought was cute it's got reindeers love hearts snowflakes christmas trees candy canes what more could you want i just really love the colors i think when it's on it's going to look like it's a proper christmas jumper even though it's like a sweatshirt does anyone know what I mean when I keep talking about that? You know how Christmas jumpers are normally meant to be like proper knitted like by your granny type <laughs> jumpers? Well this isn't, this is like a sweatshirt but I can't wait to wear it. 
So those are all of my Christmas jumpers. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, please give it a big Christmassy thumbs up. I just would love to know that you guys are enjoying this series of videos. Um, I'm normally the biggest Christmas fiend. We're having a hard one this year as a family, um, but I'm still trying to push through, enjoy the festive period and be as merry and bright as I possibly can be. Um, yeah, so that's what I'm trying to do. I hope it's coming through and you guys are enjoying it. Um, and please subscribe to my channel. I've got like new videos coming out of my ears every single day or <laughs> to get you in the festive mood. And I'm trying to do a selection, like collection videos. Um, I don't wanna like give it away what's coming up, but there's like a whole variety. It's not just gonna be like me sitting here chatting with you guys there's going to be lots of other things so yeah subscribe so that you can catch it all and that's it i hope you're having a fabulous day and i will see you again soon bye